It's going back to the way flight training used to be, learning a simple, affordable, fun-to-fly airplane. It harkens back to the days of stick and rudder training. The Cub is just the quintessential trainer. It's a, a recognizable airplane. They see the yellow airplane with the black lightning bolt, and kids and adults of all ages can relate to the Cub. And the hope is that especially young people will relate to the Cub. That's the idea behind the nonprofit Kids Fly Cubs. Future plans for Kids Fly is to contact teachers that are science teachers around the area throughout Florida and South Georgia and get them the curriculum that AOPA has. Uh, and then if those students complete that curriculum, we'll try to show up to their airport and give them a logged flight lesson. If it's uh, as successful as we hope it will be, uh, then we'll expand it throughout the country. The program was kicked off when American Legend Aircraft decided to lend its first cub named Tweety to the nonprofit to use for flight training. Legend builds factory new cubs that fall into the LSA category. Legend Aircraft co-founder Darren Hart has a long history with cubs and he sees this project as a way to pass on what he has learned over the years. Yeah, we have to get you know, more children and more kids involved in aviation and uh, fill those gaps. There's a huge demand for, for pilots for the airlines and the military too. And uh, you know, it's always, you're just, you're just passing it on from what you did in your life and you want to pass it on to others. And that's what's important. Darren's son Luke is the first to learn to fly in Twiggy. He soloed on his 16th birthday. That was, it was a lot of fun. Uh, it was scary. Like he just jumped out and told me to go and I just put it in the air before I had time to think about it. And that's what Kids Fly Cubs is all about. Going back to the roots of aviation to get kids excited about flying. I think we're seeing a, uh, a need for pilots in all facets of aviation from GA all the way up through the airlines. And we want kids to see that there's more than pushing a reset button on a computer, that you can actually go out and fly an airplane Josh Cochran, AOPA Live.